problem number six. Our front yard lawn is six feet longer than it is wide. So let's start off by where, and then um, let's see, we have a two foot wide flower garden surrounding the lawn. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to build a couple of rectangles. Okay, so if we say this is our lawn, and we'll paint this green to indicate that this is the lawn. All right, and uh, we have a flower garden, so I think it'd be appropriate if the flower garden was pink. Okay, so um, what we're going to do is we're going to identify the parts. We have a um, front yard lawn that is six feet longer than it is wide. So this is our width of our lawn. And this is the length of our lawn, which is equal to the width plus six. Okay. Uh, the total square footage of the lawn in the garden is 280 square feet. All right, so what we're going to do is we need to identify, first of all, this length right here. We need to identify how long that is. Okay, and then we also need to identify how long this is. Now, you recall that in this they tell us that the, wa the garden is two feet wide, or two foot wide, right? two foot wide. So what we're going to do is we're going to mark that on our drawing. So think about this, we've got, so this is two feet here, and this is two feet over here. We also have two feet um, here, and finally we have two feet here. Okay, so noticing here that our width actually increases by 4, 2 and 2, so this length right here is, we can consider this uh, as W plus 4. That's the expression that represents this entire length, okay, the width I should say of the garden and the lawn. Now doing the same thing here, you notice we have W plus 6 for this length right here, but then we add another 4 to that, so this now becomes W plus 10. All right. You notice that the total square footage of the lawn and the garden is 280 square feet. So if we use the rectangle formula, area re formula, area is equal to length times width, that's an L. So our length of the entire garden and lawn is W plus 10, and our entire width of the lawn and garden is W plus 4 and it's given to us that that area is 280. So at this point now we're going to multiply these two binomials. So I go W times W gives me W squared. W times 4 is 4W. Coming over to the second term of the first group I have 10 times W is 10W and then multiplying the last two terms of both groups, I have 10 times 4, which gives me 40. And that is equal to 280. Combining my like terms right here, now I get 280 is equal to W squared plus 14W plus 40. All right, so I'm going to take that equation, let's move that up here. So we have room to work, all right? And uh, in order to use the quadratic formula, we need to set one side of the equation equal to zero. So let's subtract 280 from both sides of the equation. All right, so uh, with that, this goes to zero. So this is zero, and this is w squared plus 14w minus 240. So uh, no, my coefficient of my uh, w squared term is 1, so my a equals 1, my b equals 14, and my c is equal to negative 240. 
So the width is equal to negative 14 plus or minus the square root of 14 squared minus 4, which is the same as plus negative 4, times 1 times negative 240. Alright? All over, by the way, all over 2 times 1. Following through with that, we have w is equal to negative 14. <clears throat> um, plus or minus square root 14 squared 14 squared is 196 negative 4 times 1 times negative 240 is equal to 960 And that's all over 2. Proceeding to the next step, w is equal to negative 14, plus or minus, adding those two terms together then, 196 and 960. I get 1,156, all over 2. Next. Taking the square root of negative, uh, taking the square root of 1156, I get 34. So now I have negative 14 plus or minus 34 all over 2. So think about this. This actually comes out with this plus and minus comes out to be two answers. I have W equals negative 14 plus 34 over 2. I also have w equals negative 14 minus 34 over 2. We know my width can't be negative so I know when I resolve or, or simplify this expression I'm going to wind up with w being a negative number so I'm not even going to go there. So let's just proceed with this one. So if I take negative 14 plus 34 I get 20 over 2 with the answer of the width being 10. So, what is the width of just our lawn? The answer is 10 feet. Done.